Can you hear James Brown going crazy in the background? <laughs> it is day 11, my year in food, and it is Sunday, baby. For us, that means James Brown brunch. So we are having an amazing little brunchy brunch here at home, and the best part of the weekend for me, especially Sunday, is I don't have to cook. Whoop, 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 whoop. Cheers to that. Dink. Um, my lovely man is the best. He treats me to an amazing brunch on Sunday. So today he's making his famous, should be famous, Fort Avocado Fort Benny. That's what it is. So it's beautiful. It's toast, a lovely little bit of toast with these layers of grilled tomatoes and slices of avocado. And they kind of make like this little fort. And then he does a beautifully poached egg that he drops in the middle of this little fort, avocado fort. And then you just cut it open, and it's all yummy and gooey, and ugh, it's heaven. It's so lovely. So we're gonna go and see how we do an easy poached egg, but really today it's so simple. It's just me getting someone to cook for me for a change, which I love. So I hope you all are having a great weekend, a lovely brunchy brunch yourselves. Let's go see how to poach an egg at home real easily, and that's it. James Brown, brunch, day 11, my year in food. Here we go. Right, so here's all the goodies that we're using today. We've got a beautiful ripened avocado sliced up, two little eggies, a little bit of arugula is going to go, where does that go? Just on the bottom. We've got some slices of beautifully gluten-free toast. Tomatoes. Ooh, we've got little hash browns today. Yum, yum, yum. And then, for my next trick, here is the big old pot of boiling water. Did you put any salt or vinegar? Just straight up. Vinegar. A little bit of vinegar goes in, and then we create the whirlwind. So you stir, stir, stir to create that, like, whirlpool. Gorgeous. And then we crack it and you just kind of let it keep whirling and swirling and it'll gather itself. See? So it's been about four minutes. Our beautifully easy poached egg is done. We're gonna do the same trick. We're gonna whirlwind the water all over again and then drop another egg. And then we'll see how this beautiful thing comes together in just a mouth. So we're building the fort. So you just keep layering the avo. So cute around. To make a little, almost like a little basket for our poached egg. And then we'll go in with our tomatoes and just move in. So that's how it's starting to come together. So toast. We did a little arugula on the bottom. And then these little, the slices of avocado. Okay, so we've got the grilled tomatoes. And now coming out of the pan is the gorgeous poached egg. And it goes boop, right in the middle. So cute. So we're gonna salt pepper this up a teeny bit. And you could always do a bit of sriracha or hot sauce, which I'm sure I'll do, because I love it. Teeny bit of salt. One, two. All right, so let's go cut into this and see how beautiful the inside is. This is it. So here it is, an absolute stunning plate of food for day 11, my year in food. It is the amazing, the incredible, drum roll please, avocado for Benny. So beautiful gluten-free toast, some arugula, the layers of avocado to make a little holster for that beautiful Benny egg, and some grilled tomatoes under there. Salt, pepper. I'm gonna hot sauce this and get to it. So happy, happy Sunday, happy brunch. I will see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching.